Welcome to Stream Deluxe, my name is Mr. Orange and welcome to a new video on my channel, my friends. Of course, I'm going to make a YouTube comment picker, Steam King giveaway. At the end of this video, you know all the story. Comment, like and subscribe and then you can win. Guys, 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 in this video, we will talk about the weekend. It's a weekend video. And of course, uh, before we uh, jump into everything that uh, that Steam has to offer, I like to immediately give you the little heads up what's on Epic Games. On Epic Games, you can get Ukulele and Impossible Lair. And next week, we get Windbound. And this is actually a game that I don't own yet. And Ukulele and the Impossible Lair, this is a game that has already been free. So I cannot really claim it, or I can claim it, but I already have it. So it doesn't make any sense. Guys, let's jump directly on the store page. On the store page. And. I would say, I would say, what is the most important? What is the most important cool aspect? What is what is going on today in three hours, my friend? So in three hours, Dying Light to Stay Human will come out. Dying Light Stay Human will come out. And yeah, the virus won and civilization has fallen back to the Dark Ages. The city, one of the last human settlements, is on the brink of collapse use your agility and combat skills to survive and reshape the world your choices matter my friend so teclan oh my god this game was in development like years like years five six seven years i don't know i think they announced it way too early so honestly i don't know if this game is going to be good i hope it's going to be good uh, it seems to have a huge uh, day one patch as they say so let, let's hope uh, it's from the performance it will be okay i personally decided not to buy it now since i uh, since i already know that my pc won't be able to run it and i really want to run this game uh, very nicely with good graphics so therefore i decided now to to really stop until i get my, my new machine maybe it even runs on the steam deck guys so 60 euros and then you can get a deluxe and an ultimate edition so I'll leave it to you to check out uh, those different editions. So here's the system requirements, so ray tracing off. Let's say you want to have a 30 FPS at uh, 1080 points, quality low. Then you, for example, are fine with a GeForce GTX 20, uh, 1050 Ti. So I have actually a Titan X that's a 980 Ti, a 980 Ti I have. But my problem is I have kind of an old uh, CPU and therefore that's the, the whole reason why I want to get a new PC myself. But who cares about what Mr. Orange is doing, guys? So check out the system requirements, of course, yourself. Uh, I will put you a link maybe uh, of Dying Light if you don't find this yourself, guys. So let's go back. Yeah, important to talk about Dying Light. I mean, this is the game that comes out, of course. So after the fall, after the fall, it's uh, it, this is uh, this is crazy. This game just came out the 9th of December, the, even less than a month ago, and it's already 20% down. Already 20% down. This is a, a vertical game, uh, a multiplayer port mode fps from the developer of, of horizon uh, uh, of arizona sunshine of arizona sunshine so i actually always wanted to buy this game but then it turned out it's actually not that fun people say something is missing so i'm waiting this is definitely a sale where i want to wait even more 32 euros is still i think a little bit pricey therefore i will not get this game now if we look for example here we see a lot of red thumbs down so therefore i'm not jumping on this directly and then we have another is yet another event and the event is about a game that's called stormworks built and rescue very positive rated and 17th of september in 2020 it came out so that's uh, like two two years so so you create and you pilot own air and sea rescue services release your inner hero as as you battle fierce storms out at sea to rescue those in need yeah okay so it's a bit sandbox sandbox thingy a sandbox thingy okay yeah well that's nothing for me and then we have session skateboarding sim game a skateboarding game my friends creativity and freedom of expression and don't i have this game actually i no i don't have this game ah, i have another skating game i think it's called skate xl or something 
yeah, skate, skate the XL. This is the one I have session. I don't have so mostly positive now came out in 2019. Publisher is Naken, still in early access now for 15 euros. I'll see a lot of thumbs up. So yeah, maybe that's good. Maybe that's a good skating game. If you're into skating games, of course, guys, if not then uh, yeah, it doesn't make sense that you get a game like this. Then we have Wade's Interactive, a multi-award winning video games and interactive movie publisher and developer based in South Wales. Made of Square, Bloodshore, The Complex, Five Dates. Ah, all right, those, those are the interactive movies. They make those games mostly. All right, so Square of Ritual and Made of Square. Made of Square is a good game. Square of Ritual looks also kind of fun. And uh, yeah, that's, I think the idea behind those interactive movies is it's good, I mean, but I personally, uh, I don't see myself paying now 10 euros for a movie, even if the movie is interactive, since I have uh, Netflix and streaming and, and all of this. So, Rivals of Ether, or Ether, is an indie fighting game where wearing simulation summon the power of fire, water, air and earth, blah, blah, blah. Overwhelming positive, 2017, 2D fighter, pixel graphics. Here we go, multiplayer, everything there, everything you need, everything you want, 60% down. Maybe this game is for you if you have some friends to hang out on the canopy. And then my friends, we have the Games from Quebec 2022 edition. So welcome to the Games from Quebec. And I think I was covering this already last year. So they say it was successful last year. So they are doing it again. Awesome. City War Savage, the indie MMORPG release soon. Can we just download demos? Nah, I don't see actually the opportunity here. Uh, the possibility, sorry. PewDiePie's game, we happy few, the girl and the robot. So we have some, some kind of some deals uh, to check out day of infamy infamy lara croft for two euros away speed brawl mirador mirador action indie difficult so and blood drop blood roots and panzer panzer paladin i always looked actually at this game and kind of like that the idea of this game so and then a lot of other titles oh even squadrons in the uh, Star Wars Square this is a game from Quebec. So in Quebec, uh, il parle français. C'est très bien. <laughs> All right, guys. So in search and see, Sandstorm, 50% down. Almost, uh, yeah, more down than uh, Meter. Facebook stock today. <laughs> Battlefield 2042, 42% down. And Tribes of Midgard. And Medal of Honor above and beyond the VR version, only 20% down. Well, that's not really a lot. And then Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. And I asked you the other day, I asked you if I shall get, get keys for this game. If I should get keys for this game, guys. So, and no one, okay, one single person was answering on this, guys. So I know you like uh, Steam key giveaway. So if you don't like them, I stop them immediately. I will stop them immediately because uh, I mean, why would I do them anyways? Then because no one wants to participate. So just give me a no if you don't like Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. It's fine now. <laughs> Over with the rent, guys. So Star Wars. <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy, 35% down, my friends. Uh, Formula 1, 2021, 77% down. That's interesting. But this is a game where I wait that it comes to the to the EA Play, to the EA Play package. All right, so that's it. Mostly the new and trending, The Wanderer, where we're positive, or The Wanderer, I think is the name of a, of a song. Mirror News Center, this looks funny. Then top sellers, of course, Dying Light. I mean, uh, everyone is waiting for this game. Then Elden Ring, ready or not, those are now the top sellers for sure. The Land of Screens, popular upcoming games, Werewolf, Werewolf, The Apocalypse, Earthblood. So Oli Oli World. So I talked about this already in videos. I, 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 I see that people are not really interested in upcoming games. That's okay, guys. That's okay. And then let's jump to my library. And now I have to fight the recent one. So the recent. So recently I got Blood West for review. So I got yeah Blood West. I got for review purposes. And what shall I say, guys? This is a really really fun RPG uh, pixel art games. So it comes out the 10th of February. So I'm uh, I'm trying to play it uh, some more. 
and it's definitely has a lot of potential so uh give it give it a try give it a look uh, at least uh check it out check out the reviews of course when it comes out maybe maybe it's a game that you like it has some rpg element in my opinion so retro rpg horror elements uh, mixed with some good old pixel art fps uh, shooting uh, mechanics so still in early access but yeah as i said it's worth the look all right my friends so that's it and i would say let's go and choose the winner of my youtube comment picker steam key go away and the winner is ba -ba, john hicker looks good and super handy and john hicker my god how many games did you win already <laughs> yeah everyone actually on my channel already won several keys so guys I think I think we need some new need some some new viewers uh, that participate. It's not against those that already won several times. I always send you your keys, guys. You know this, but I want to have a bit more diversity, of course, in this. Set. So, but I understand you don't want other people to come on this channel. But I tell you one thing: if we get more people on my channel, the games get better. The games get better because I'm buying all of those Steam keys myself. And of course, I'm buying them with my uh, <laughs> with the money that I get from YouTube for it. So, all right, guys, with this, I'm leaving it here, and I wish you a wonderful weekend. And see you tomorrow, or yeah, see you tomorrow in a new new video. So, I hope I don't have to make uh, a Dying Light 2 uh, release as a total disaster video. But if it is a total disaster, I will make a video like this. So, <laughs> thank you very much. See you next time.